Hello again. Welcome back. I'm Sherry with Palette to Palette, and today we're going to work on our um, boho arch, which is just um, a three-layered wall decor piece, but I wanted to paint it. Uh, we don't really need an assembly tutorial for it, but um, I started doing videos on most of my projects and I wanted to keep up with that. So even though this one doesn't really need assembly because it's just three pieces layered, I figured I'd paint. So I'm going to paint it and um, see how easy it is to come up with this uh, boho farmhouse-y um, look. And um, I use um, baby wipes and I use makeup sponges. So the baby wipes, because there's moisture in them, when I wipe them on, it thins the paint out so it looks a little bit like stain. And I like that because it dries quickly and it doesn't smell. Um, in the look that I have, uh, most of my pieces back there are um, either done using a baby wipe or done using a makeup sponge. So, so that's what I use. So let's get to it. So this is the piece that I'm talking about. And it's three layers. Okay, and when you're going to assemble it, you're just going to glue all three of those layers together and um, center each one on the next, and then you're done, and it's a beautiful piece of um, wall art. And let's see what we've got here. The largest one is, oh, it's nine, just shy of 19 and three quarters by, I think it's 10, um, 10 and an eighth. Okay, so um, you should be able to do this one on the Glowforge, I believe. I don't have a Glowforge anymore, so um, I know that sometimes it was hard to kind of squeeze that, that 10 in, um, but you should be able to do that. And we're just going to paint because assembly is easy, right? So I'm going to do um, a brown and then a cream color in the middle and then a brown on the top again. Um, my mom actually sent me a picture and she's like, can you make something like this for my wall? And of course, I said, sure. <laughs> so I'm going to get my two colors of paint. And the baby wipe, and I just wrap it around my fingers and dip it in the paint and start swiping. But see how it's it's thinned out and it looks like it looks more like stain than paint. I really like that look. And the paint goes further too, because it's thinning it out as it goes, so it doesn't really use a whole lot. I hope I didn't lose your attention already. You're going to want to see how this ends up, as am I. <laughs> this file will be posted on my Etsy, which will be, my Etsy link is in the description. As soon as I get it painted and can take some staged photos, I'll get it posted on my Etsy. Okay, so I've got that back layer um, painted. Set this on here. I'm going to paint the front layer the same, and it's only the middle layer that I'm painting the other color. And that one's the middle. <laughs> I almost got confused for a second, or I did get confused. Thank you. 
I'm just wiping it on there. Right now I'm kind of scrubbing it on there because I probably should get a little bit more. Okay, now we've got plenty. Okay, so that's my front. Now I'm going to do the middle. And because it's this cream color and I don't really want to thin that out, I will use the makeup sponge instead of a baby wipe. And I hope this gives it the look that I'm going for. What do you think? Yay or nay? Now, if you're a laser owner or a DIY um, enthusiast, um, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. It's new. Sorry, that's my air compressor. Let me turn that off. I don't have a lot of videos on my YouTube channel yet, but I'm working on it. I'm uploading one um, every time I make a new file. And I'm selling the, um, I'm offering the blanks and uh, finished product as well as the files. So if you're interested in the tutorials, go ahead and subscribe, give my channel a like. Um, I'm not trying to get anywhere where, you know, monetization or anything like that on YouTube. It's it's strictly for the purpose of having the, um, the videos so that you guys can get to my files or the blanks or the finished pieces. I guess it's just so I can be a show off. <laughs> just showing off. I really love this cream color. So as I was saying, um, go ahead and give it a like, um, follow, subscribe, whatever it is that we do on, on YouTube. I don't even know all the, the ins and outs of it yet. I know how to record a video and I know how to upload a video and um, type things into the description field. I don't know how to, I mean, I could probably figure out how to edit a video, but what I say is what you're going to get. <laughs> I'm not, I'm not spending the time editing them. Um, obviously I have other things to do. And I don't know if you can hear my doggy barking or not, but not, ed not editing that out either. Now he's going to howl because he thinks I'm not home. <laughs> Hold on a Sorry, I'm not editing. <laughs> it is what it is. He's just getting older and he doesn't want to be left alone and he if he can't see me in the same room, he thinks I'm gone. And so he starts howling, poor guy. And I show him that I'm here and then he's fine. I'm 
little bit more over here. And I think that just needs to dry for a second and then that will be done. So, let's see what it's gonna look like. You like it so far? I do. That cream needs to dry just a little bit. Yep, it's exactly what I was going for. Look at that. Nice. All right, so I'm going to glue this all down and uh, take my photos, and then this file will be available on my um, in my Etsy shop momentarily. Have a great day. Bye.